Hey guys, what's up? This is the evening show, and this is sixth grade memories. And it's also gonna be three part series because tomorrow we're gonna have seventh grade memories. Not tomorrow. tomorrow. Yes, Boy. tomorrow. Next week. I'm Jacob. That's Johnny. You guys introduce yourselves, also. I'm Albert. I'm Mac. What's up, it's Dan. Put a little six up there. Put a little six. <laughs> or a big one. I don't know. It's up to you. Or a small one, like a really small one, and then it like grows to be a really big one. Is that possible? Do that. It just goes yeah. like. No. Take away my request and do that. Anyways, sixth grade. Sixth grade started out. Yeah. <laughs> it sixth started grade. out pretty confusing. Basically, when we got there, our homeroom teacher, Miss Quinn, me, Ian, and Jacob. Our, our homeroom teacher, Miss Quinn, was not Miss Quinn or there. We need a sub. Yeah, did, like, you ever, did we like ever find out who the other candidate was? It was other like Miss. I remember, I remember the name. Before, like the name that was on the list was like Miss Daisy or something. No, so me, me and Johnny, I remember, Miss we Owens. walked into that my homework because I'm responsible, guys. And his wired AirPods. Yeah. Um. <laughs> so I remember me and Johnny were walking around the first day, and we walked into every single classroom because we we I forget what the girl's name was like. I think it was like Miss yeah. Daisy or Miss Daisy. Something like that. It was me a flower. Had no idea who it was gonna be, so we walked in and this sub. I, like the sub was like, didn't even know what she was even doing. I know. Like, like on the we went day, in there and we were like, "Hey, is this our class? We like, are like, we on the Ian roster?" Tucker and Johnny Perry. And, and she was like, "I don't know." And she was like, "No." And she was like, <laughs> "Y'all are on the list." She said, "No." And so then we, then we walked back around one time. She's like, "Oh yeah, y'all on the list." And we were like, "Hold up." <laughs> we were like this close to crying, just like tiny sixth graders in a hallway. Yeah. Okay. Thinking that we got kicked out of Meg's because we weren't on any okay. list. Okay. And, and, then, and then I remember me, me and Johnny sat down, and the first thing that, funny, funny story, Jacob. First thing that Johnny says is, we, sh we should go ahead and sit down right here. Let's, let's leave a spot open for Jacob. And that's the first thing that he said. Wow. Wait, that's, that's really the first thing you said? That Johnny said whenever we sat down. He was like, go to this table. It's got like another space open. Dang, I'm so honored. Yeah. You build, you fill my bucket right there. Please stop. But anyway. Oh, Johnny. Did we just have like an earthquake in the library? <laughs> no, you turned. For like the first half, ha half of, of the first. Oh, yeah of our English literacy arts class and also our homeroom, we had a sub. And so it was like kind of awkward because we didn't know who our teacher was. And we were scared that she'd come in and be like really weird and mean. And, and then yeah. she was really weird and mean, Miss Quinn. Just kidding, we're <laughs> kidding, we're kidding. She would understand that's a joke. She was one of the freshest teachers uh, Like, in my okay. Career. I the feel most like, awesome. what? Most amazing. I feel like in sixth grade, the teachers were just really dope. Yeah, yeah. we had a sixth good set of teachers. It's like, they were all like new. We had Miss Quinn, Mr. Nam. Miss Buckner Wait, wasn't Buckner. mute. That's, that's, that's all the new ones. By the way, how was Mr. I, oh, Mr. Parsons' class being secluded all the time meant like we could do like, he could change up whatever we were doing from like whatever was set for the day. Yeah, so. like let you go on the playground when everybody else had to walk laps. Uh, I remember, I remember I would always like be walking by on my regular school day and like accidentally glimpse out of a window and see Mr. Parsons class out there just chilling it out on the playground and I'd be yeah. like, hmm. That was hmm, pretty fun. How does it feel? Felt pretty good. Privileged. Yeah. Well, and then um, also we, um. Go to Subway like every day and. Every. Oh, every Basically, day. if you're in fifth grade, you better hope you get in Mr. Parsons class because. Sixth grade. Dirter. No, if you're in fifth if you're grade. In fifth grade. Oh. <laughs> yeah, you're the dirter around here. <laughs> you're Durder. the dirter. Why is that on the desk? I like roll. to play that with it sometimes. Our, that just our now we have to restart. No. What's up, guys? This is Meg's Johnny. Here. This is Jacob. Oh my God. This is the next so morning show. Don't. Shot. No. Okay. Oh, we're, that we're, gonna, we're gonna. We're oh, gonna. Um, so, Mr. Numb. Okay. That was a big part of Monsieur Nam. <laughs> Mr. Nam, we're like the lamest teacher to ever grace Megs. And that is why I am more of his favorite than you. Just kidding, Mr. Nam was really cool. He was super awesome. Also really cool. And he was our teacher. He was super new, so like the thing was, people like to- Mr. Nam, if you're watching this, you see that curly cue? 
It's an inside joke. It he was, was I went to his magic in Richmond. Oh. Did, did you go the first quarter or the second quarter? Second, second quarter. Uh, y'all trash. Like, basically, Mr. Nam was a new teacher. He was young. He was hip. And, and also, he got me into cards. He also, like, did magic. And so, people, like, loved him. But since he was new, he didn't really know how to control his classroom. So it was just, like, chaos in I, okay. Oh, okay. yeah, yeah. I'll, oh, I'll, I'll, I'll explain <laughs> this. Because it, I was in his third period, and it was chaos in there. Oh, uh, All, Mr. Nump's third and, period and, is and always, and like, so, so we're like, his favorite class. But so Albert, anyway, tell us the story. <laughs> so, it all really started... He was teaching, and then he did a bunch of silly movements, and it got a few chuckles out of the class. A few chuckles. A few chuckles, chuckles Wild, as as Wild one body does. Laughs. Wild so eventually, it, like he had this really cool drawing app, and he drew all sorts yeah, of stuff, yeah. and all we his math started stuff. cheering for him to draw stuff on there. Um, for like it was what uh, Carfax uh, for the it, Carfax. It was, Show it me was the Carfax. Basically for. Each equation, there was like a quick facts part of it where he wrote down the yeah. given information. They called it like car facts, and people laughed at that. Oh, and it yeah. was just a whole bunch of different um, things that occurred. Uh, and then it eventually led to after every sentence he, ev or after every sentence he said, they laughed. And it became such a problem that... A blessing he, and a curse. He told, Yeah, he told us that, um, like, three months out that he was going to leave Megs and go teach somewhere He else. told you before he told me? Yes. No, he told me, like, like half... He told me in, like, December. He told me on, like, his last day. Yeah, he told us in, like, February, January. What? Well, we did throw it awesome party for him though. <laughs> yeah, and I'm sure he hated he, it because y'all probably laughed and were loud. No, he loved it. Oh, we that's what he told me. That's, that's at least what he said. Well, the entire grade threw a party for Miss Gwynn on her birthday. True. Mm. But another big thing that happened in sixth grade was the uh, <laughs> Country yeah, Music Hall of Fame field trip. So basically what Miss Quinn did was she assigned us homework that we didn't know like at the time what it was going to be used for, but it was basically like write a country music song and so i was like i i'm not really gonna try on this and then later she revealed that like if it was, it was good yeah it was a competition that like a pro singer would be singing it at the country music hall of fame and so then i was like dang a pro singer <laughs> i completely for forgot what my song was about but anyways it was just a song competition with whoever wrote the best song would get their song performed by a singer songwriter and so i like at that point like had to beat out everybody else so i went home that night i like thank tank me and my brother had like a recording tank. session thank tank yes they rhyme in johnny's vocabulary Fun I don't have a country accent. <laughs> I don't have a country accent. That's Johnny. All right, continue. And so basically, I uh, I didn't really know what to write about until I came to school the next day, and something tragic happened, guys. My rat Pixel passed away. Picture of him right there, and it was really tough for me. And so I I was really fragile, really raw. I went to school the next day. Didn't you kill it? <laughs> <laughs> not not that remember. one. That was the other ride. Oh. No, that uh, was Pixel. No, that was no, that Pixel was, Jr. That was Nate. Kid. Maybe you killed Nate, too, right? Wait, Pixel, Pixel Jr. Child? <laughs> <laughs> Just and no. so, basically, Nate was so. Nate uh, was Nate. All right, that's another rat. All right, just. Nash one of my, one of my rats' right. name was Nate. So we. <clears throat> he was like the big, fat, greedy one, and Pixel was super small super tiny, malnourished, and basically every time we would give them like food, Nash would just like body pixel <laughs> off the thing. And he would like slam him into a wall, which I didn't even know like rats could do this, but they were like cage fighting, except it was only one way. And so basically Pixel just never ate, uh, eventually died. So I went to school the next didn't day. Didn't he also have respiratory issues? Yeah, rats, they like all do. Mm. I won't call it any names, but I was sharing with the class how my rat had tragically passed away, and somebody in the crowd had the nerve to say, I don't care. 
and it really hurt me. In the crowd? There in was a crowd? There was a crowd. It was the class. It was the class. The, the rest crowd. of the class. Someone in the audience. I think Miss Buckner. Wait, you had a show and tell in Miss Quinn's class. Ow. I called a, and it I was called a your, class your, your, meeting. Your dead rat's corpse. <laughs> <laughs> hey, guys, look at this. <laughs> I called a meeting. I was like, all right, class, assemble. I have to no, tell Ms. you something. No, Miss Buckner asked what happened over the weekend, and, and, and you raised <laughs> your hand, no, it was and you said my rat died, and, you, and, this, and somebody oh, was like, I don't care. <laughs> but anyways, that... That lit a fire in me, a fire which could only be extinguished through the power of music. And so I went home that night, I wrote up some lyrics, I jotted down some verses, I scribbled down some words in a musical manner, and I brought them to school the next day and it was a beautiful country song. Drop it on my SoundCloud soon. All right, let me hit you with a little bit of it, okay? All right, hit me with a beat. A, a, Slow gu or a fast. guitar beat. Wait. Banana down. Banana down. down, 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 down. What is that? Stop. <laughs> That's slow. Old oh, pixel is tailgating in rat heaven. But I can't say his name. We'll call him John, John Doe. Doe. Yeah. But John Doe is bound for somewhere else down there. <laughs> Three words sent me into a deep depression. I'll miss him till I join him there myself. My dear Pixel left so soon and left his family lonely. He had so How many. How much of this do you remember? <laughs> <laughs> Keep the beat going. He had so many attributes that made him one and only. My Pixel left. Yeah, all right, that's, that's all, all we remember. need. All right, okay. That was okay. actually pretty good. Thank My you. beat really put yep. the icing on the cake. Okay, but look, look, look. Okay, I had a concept that I didn't end up doing, but I'm just going to give you a quick preview. Don't give me a beat. It, it speaks for itself. Hey, where are my feet in a bucket? <laughs> okay. <laughs> hey, why are my feet in a bucket? In a bucket. Hey, why are my feet in a bucket? In a bucket. Hey. Why are my feet in a bucket, in a bucket, and that's it. Why was that <laughs> okay, there we go. And you know what? All the kids are going, um, uh, this week they're going on all the Country Music Hall fame trips. Oh, oh, good luck with that, guys. I yeah. hope you guys get featured on this meme review. pro singer-songwriter. Yeah. Also, that's all we have time for today. I'm sorry, but if you guys want to watch more episodes, click this. If you guys <laughs> click the green screen, that's that equals pause on YouTube. <laughs> if you guys don't want to watch more episodes, click that dislike button, and we'll see you Whoa. guys later. <laughs> here, here. Okay. Wait, wait. <laughs>